Let me lift my holes up. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I want to start it off by just saying thank you for Matt for my new helmet. I absolutely love it. And thank you to everyone that's like helped me so far in my MTB journey and just supported me. So like Pembury, Common Soul, GoPro. Everyone's just really that's helped me and everyone that's like following me, interacting with everything. I have been sacking recently. I promised to get back on it. But today it's just going to be a vloggy little ride. It's bloody freezing, so I don't know how long it's going to be, but hopefully send some new sh** too. Yeah, it's been a couple of weeks since you've ridden, so... Yeah, it has been about two, three weeks. Three. And I've also stolen Yanni's goggles, so... How are you feeling with the pink? Pink's my colour, pink's my yeah. I kind of want to do a little challenge with that, where I ask a mountain bike question as I follow her. And that would be really interesting. But it could also end in tears, seeing as she almost came off there. Oh shit, forgot to put my goggles down. You barely see. Did you see me really mess that up? Hey? Did you see me go really to the side on that first jump? Yeah, you pretty much hit the bank. <laughs> I thought it was over for you. Well, I've got a new helmet, so it's fine. I would have been safe, but I didn't, forgot to put my goggles down. Yeah, hang on. <laughs> I'm surprised I didn't snap into your face. Yeah, I know, same. Dropping in, following yeah. Yanni. In this video, I wanted to talk a bit more about how I've actually got sponsors and stuff, because I know a lot of people are like, how did she get sponsored? So, with Pembury, they just found me on Instagram, saw my YouTube, so that'd be a good fit. God knows why, because they've got amazing people on their team. But yeah, they took an interest, messaged me, sent me an email, and I'm at the bottom of the room before I've even finished talking. There's quite a little food in here and there. Yeah. And people have been super nice about it. Everyone's so nice about it. I don't know why. I don't. <laughs> And yeah, I don't accept every single brand deal. <laughs> go for the ones that are right for you. Um, oh, don't go, oh, I want free stuff. Yeah, I'll do it. It's not worth it. But whether you see yourself fitting into their... Yeah, you need to fit into their style, their brand. Know that you'd buy it anyway. So it kind of just makes sense. Well, but if you wouldn't buy it, why promote it? Yeah, because you already had a GoPro. Yeah. And we look like the GoPro they had there. Little glitches once they smash into the floor. And a couple of get times. Get dropped into snow. Yeah. Get left in snow. Yeah, get my bad. Get dropped down wooden stairs. Yeah. And yet I'm still wearing it. And it's still working fine for you, but yeah. it just worked better for us having two. 
Um, you already had a Met parachute helmet. The helmet, yeah, I already had a Met parachute. I used to tag them a hell of a lot on Instagram. And then they noticed that I had the older version, so they've come out with the new 2022 version. Messaged me, asked me if I wanted the latest one, and hell yeah, it's sick. Yeah. So. Right, Yanni's dropping in behind me. So I've just talked about Hungary and now I'm going to talk about Common Soul. So they saw how much I love their brand and how I've got a really old meta and read it up. And I've got so much traction after I um, re-sprayed it and stuff. They just asked me to come on board with their lifestyle range. They love the lifestyle range. Oh, it's so sick. Lucky. I got so lucky on this last bit. Did you see how I nosedived? Why? Right, what did you do? Front end washed out and it just, it slipped and then somehow hit a bit of grippy mud and caught it. I'll have to do that slow mo on the GoPro if it caught it. If it shows it. <laughs> I'm on mission to try and catch her up now then. Oof! Front end washed out a little bit there. Grippy these bad boys are. Best in the game. Anyway, I'm gonna film Yanni side profile coming down. So I never film him. What is my hood doing? This bloody wind. Anyway, let's get him coming down. Oh, roll this. Oh, 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 oh. Honestly, I love this place. It's good in the wet, it's good when it's dry. And do you reckon we should go back to Woburn at some point? Oh yeah, 100%, but at the moment, my focus is architecture. My focus is bossing my exams and I'm still there. working full time. Yeah, you work full time and you're trying to become a chartered accountant. Yeah. I'm trying to become a part two architect. Mate, we'll be raking it in one day. Especially yes. how many bikes we could have. Or give to people. Yeah. That would be the goal though. Um, that's what I want to, like, in the future, that's what I want to do. I want to, like, get more people that aren't fortunate enough into mountain biking because it is so expensive. Yeah. And, like, when I first started out, it was a bit daunting, like, spending so much money, especially if I wasn't going to enjoy it. I mean, I knew I'd get hooked, but it is, like, the new pads cost so much and everything costs so much and I'd be so lucky because I've been gifted a lot, but it's just, like, it's pretty expensive. So we're in good positions now. Yeah. But like, there are some people that never get into a good position. I know earlier on, I wasn't in a good position. Good. Fucking go out. Well, I think my bike was it. 400 pounds when I first bought it, and then I gradually built it up when my I could afford it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And it had holes drilled in the miles up front. Think how bad my frame was. My frame was so bad. Your frame was like rust and bubbly. Yeah. Like but you make do with what you've insane. got. Yeah, because you could have just gone out and gone, oh, well, I'm into biking now, I'll spend two, three grand for bikes. But I'm not, I've kept with the same bike, I've done it off and I love it. I've kept the same £400 bike and loved it, which is how it should be. Yeah. to drop there and then you meant to land about here this is the takeoff for the jump this is the landing and then it goes into the corner and then it's got a couple more jumps and whatnot and then it goes in, oh then it goes into a step up Miyani's coming down now so he'll show you where he's at I mean luckily he's getting his confidence back now which is good moves.
did it! How, how do I get something in my eye? I'm wearing goggles. You're wearing goggles. See, was it that bad? So when I first ever hit the step up, you probably can't see it, but it's over there. Um, it was wet like this. I think that's what gave me the confidence to do it today. So when I first ever hit it, it was chucking it down. But that being said, it does make it harder because it runs a lot slower and the wind's really like pushing you backwards. So I'm struggling for speed today. So I'm not clearing it as far as I have, but it's all about having fun really, isn't it? Like, I suppose it doesn't matter if you don't hit it clean every time because conditions do change just as long as you're having fun. Happy guy who finally did it because that just gave him another confidence boost after breaking his back. But let's go send it again and get him to do it. Get this. Something went wrong with him. What happened? Oh, his foot came off the pedal a little and then his seat boxed him. And I felt a good run though. I could definitely build it up more when I come next time, like commit to the other jumps coming down. But still having fun. Right, so that's it for this video. If you did enjoy, like and subscribe down below. Um, got some other sketchy footage which we've not actually put in a video yet have we so after this outro i'm gonna add that in i mean it wasn't really a gap jump thing that i was doing it was just like a route that i was jumping off so it was sketchy yeah my technique probably wasn't the best i cleared it nice on a couple of occasions but you'll see in the footage that i'm about to show uh i had great fun i want to be riding longer but got stuff to do i'm buzzing about my new helmet i'll do a proper review on that very soon so enjoy the footage i'm about to show you but for now that's the end of the video so peace out oh i love my new helmet squeaky uh, do you know what i actually am really squeaky in videos do, do you know the way when bike park video yeah when i was like i did it i can't i can't even watch it yeah, i'm so really squeaky bad, yeah. You go giddy little girl. Yeah, when I get excited about things, I need to stop. It's embarrassing. Anyway, yeah, leaving that video here. <laughs>